Safety in the fire service is imperative. Being able to perform the job safely and easily and quickly is critical to their ability to return home and also to get the operation done in a uh, rapid manner. The Albany Fire Department was in need of thermal imagers and we'd like to get thermal imaging cameras for all of our riding positions. We have a multitude of tools to carry. We're pushing 60, 70 plus pounds of additional equipment to go into a fire and having a lightweight tool that is a multi-purpose tool helped to be won over by members of the fire service that utilize it every day. Having a seek in every riding position is a huge benefit to us. They're able to move faster and able to locate the seat of the fire faster and are able to do um, searches more quickly. The use of the thermal imager is not just for firefighting. I feel our members have termed it more of a multi-purpose tool. We're finding that in the hazmat situation, we're able to look at levels of tanks, and we also are surrounded by highways. We're a major transportation hub, so we have a lot of product flowing on the highways. So in the event of an emergency, we're able to quickly evaluate the amount of product that's in these vehicles with the help of a, a thermal imager. Every member has the ability to have thermal imaging, not just for fire attack purposes, but for a multitude of calls. Dispatch has received a call that two boys, ages seven and eight, have been reported missing south of 151 near Morgan Road. Last seen, approximate time is 5.30 p.m. Request search and rescue teams. It's really important that we keep our firefighters safe and that we also keep our community safe. We had an incident recently where the firefighters rolled up, it wasn't clear where the fire was, and they were able to use the technology to determine exactly where the fire was so that they could move quickly and extinguish that fire and prevent it from becoming something bigger. It really helps to save buildings and save lives.